Well, hello there. Uh, welcome back. It's it's gonna be um, what do we even say? It will be a uh, another voting session here. I think the odds on the winner tonight will are kind of well similar to what they were. Did we watch 1964 yesterday or is it two days ago? I'm actually going to block this up because of course I'm going to be submitting my votes now. The deadline is closing right as I do it. Uh, and I have mine noted down so I'll just fix them here. You can't see anything. Good, good, good. Um, I will keep these as a surprise for all of you. But I'm just arranging them now real quick. Uh, and in the meantime I think all of you should look into your predictions predict a top three for me get those in right away while i sit here and fix this uh and we'll see if anyone will be correct today i think we had a few people who were correct yesterday didn't we um the top three yesterday was of course uh italy luxembourg and austria who are also the three songs that you've heard now in the beginning and ending of these three streams uh it's getting late so we're we're gonna start try and get through this one pretty quick but um, one would have imagined that there weren't maybe that many people voting today well you'd be wrong because uh, I can tell you this much there are triple digits amounts uh, I'm saving my votes now so deadlines closing in three two one there we go no more votes allowed from now on let's uh, open we got 1965 so now I can start sharing this again there we go Let's actually just do, uh, yeah, kind of, can, no, of course it can't. All right, it is what it is. Um, so yeah, we have uh, 103 voters, not quite as many as we've had now for a while, but I mean, still, considering we've had, like, all of the mess that I put all of you through today, still have 103 people who decided to vote, which is just amazing. Um, Groot, can you check if my votes are in? They are, Bruno, but you didn't you didn't follow my instructions. You should probably try writing a different name that <laughs> won't get stolen. Because anyone else could also name themselves Bruno, and then we don't know who's who, and that would be an issue. Uh, I don't I don't demand you to do that, but it might be a good idea moving forward because people like to ruin this. Coast, yeah, you you're you're gone. We're also going to check through very, very quickly that there are no super inappropriate names here. Uh, as it starts raining outside. Wonderful. Uh, looks good. I like my men like I like my grapes 20 at a time. Sure. Uh, <laughs> Tony Johansson hillade 1964 mer än 1965 Jag också Tony Jag också um, Groot's grandma Boom bang a bang stan ack It's very tempting to just click delete here Don't work on Sunday, don't sleep on Monday What? <laughs> Uh, yeah, okay, all of these look good. Of course, I have the cha-cha-cha as well in here. Very, uh, what's it called? Very um, dedicated voter. Check for offensive votes. I did exactly that. I'm the second voter now, earliest I've been. Turkey 2004 is over. Why are we talking about Turkey 2004? But no, it's not overrated. His holiness to... Oh, I can't... You'll have to forgive me, Your Holiness, but you're too late. You missed the deadline. Not even the Pope gets through with this. Bye-bye. <laughs> uh, there we go. All right, we're going to start watching the voting right away. We have... Wait, wait, how many were there? 103? Yep, 103. All right. So I didn't pay attention to any of your predictions. What what did we think, top, th top three? As I start very slowly here. Neo... Politan Unirals, well, uh, we got some Luxembourg, Austria, Ireland, Luxembourg, Austria, Yugoslavia, Luxembourg, UK, Austria, yeah, everyone's predicting Luxembourg to win, we'll see if that's gonna happen. <laughs> First points on the board there, and 8 points to Italy, 10 points to Luxembourg, and our first 12 will go to Sweden, that's an unexpected first 12, I'd say, 
But yeah, there we go. Sanomi Spava, voter number two. And uh, more songs getting their first points. Almost all of them already got some. Eight points to Luxembourg, ten points to Austria. And the 12 goes to the Netherlands to go up into third now. <laughs> Tear in my eye over that name. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, Empo is our third voter. And after this one, we only have 100 to go. Uh, there we go. More songs getting their first points as well. Austria with an 8. Yugoslavia with a 10. And the 12 to Luxembourg. There we go. Luxembourg, Austria, Netherlands, the current top three. Genghis Khan, nice to see you back. Every, oh, sorry. Every song has now already gotten points, nice to see. France with 8, Ireland with 10, and the 12 goes to Luxembourg there. Luxembourg pulling away <laughs> an early lead. Very close for second though, all the way from second to fifth, only one point in it. Liz, voter number 5. Uh, some movement there for the top few spots, excluding the first, of course. Yugoslavia with 8, 10 to Finland, and the 12 to Luxembourg. Yeah. And Styro from Moldova is the next voter. First points on the board there. Uh, 8 points to Luxembourg. 10 points to Ireland to move up into second on debut. Uh, only to lose it for Austria there. Going up into second now, one point ahead of Ireland. Uh, Pie Man, voter number seven. Lower points on the board there. Italy moves up into the top half. Ten points to Ireland to go back up into second. And the 12 to Luxembourg. Of course, Luxembourg already has two wins in this contest. Could they really make it a third in the first 10 years? That's like that's the point we're at. After watching today, we've watched 10 of the like the, the 10 first years of Eurovision. If Luxembourg gets three wins out of 10, that's just mind blowing. Got another 12 here from Vilma. Let's put them further ahead at the top. And J is the next voter. Uh, 8 more points for Austria there, 10 points to Italy, and a 12 to Luxembourg. <laughs> um, yeah, Luxembourg, yeah, I mean, I think most of us are expecting uh, Parchetti Kutsumuaku N O N E Lukosa. Yeah, 10 points to Ireland and a 12 to Luxembourg. All right, Adrian from Sweden. You and me, we're still up at 2.30 a.m. over here. Uh, some points for the right side of the scoreboard there. Eight points to Netherlands to go up into fourth. 10 to Italy. And the 12 to Luxembourg at the top. What happened to Spain? Uh, Spain was, was, were they high before? I, don't, I didn't even realize. They're in... Um, they are in 11th, I think. Uh, 8 points to Ireland, 10 points to Austria, and the 12 from Joey goes to Luxembourg again. And next is Portugal. I you predicted Germany second? Well, they're second from the bottom at the moment. <laughs> that can change, of course. I'm voter 13 now. 8 points to Ireland, 10 points to Luxembourg, and the 12 goes to Finland to move up into 6th, uh, that would be, I think. Yep. Uh, Aya Nation. Uh, Ireland now into the 100s, up on debut, that's quite the score. Uh, 8 points to Luxembourg, 10 points to Italy to move up into 4th, and the 12 goes to Austria. Good, I've got 6 wins, a 2nd place and a 10th place in the last 8 crew divisions, what do you say now? Well, I mean, it's very different from the from the 80s, <laughs> and yet you still find a way to complain in every voting session. I, I find it fascinating, Andy. Uh, Eric gives 10 points to Austria and a 12 to Yugoslavia. Nothing for Luxembourg there. Wow. That's, that's, that's a first. Uh, Stevie from Australia, voter number 16. First points there. Italy and Netherlands moves up. 
8 points to Ireland, 10 points to Austria, and the 12 to Luxembourg. Extending the gap there. Yafil, next one to vote. Some points there for Switzerland at the bottom. Everyone's in the double digits. Uh, 8 points to Austria, 10 points to Ireland, and the 12 goes to Luxembourg. Um, yeah, Luxembourg, Ireland, and Austria are really putting some distance <laughs> down to the down to the rest. And of course, Luxembourg have their own distance down to the rest as well. And then from Yugoslavia down to Portugal, also quite a gap. Uh, eight points to Spain here from I have no idea. Ten points to Austria, and the twelve to Luxembourg again. All right, vote number nineteen. We're already like almost a fifth through. Uh, that says something when we have uh, a few fewer voters, then it goes a little bit quicker. Uh, 8 points to Netherlands here from Remix Original, 10 points to Norway, that's huge for them at the right side, and another 12 for Luxembourg, who are now on the 200 mark. Um, Jeffrey is voter number 20. And these are the first points, 8 more points for Norway there, 10 points to Monaco. And a 12 to Luxembourg at the top. These are my votes, but there is another I have no idea voting later on. Really? Really? You tell me now. Is there really another one who named yourself who named the same? Sorry about this, everyone. Is there really another one who's named that? Okay. I'm deleting this one. And um, yeah, we've got some more people who missed the deadline here. Well, we're doing it again. <laughs> 102 voters should be the case now. We're on voter number 21, Kevin. Oh, wait, no, that's not how you do. Okay, we'll see what the speed is like now. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's super slow, maybe it's super fast. Doesn't look very fast at the moment. I think I can speed this up. Yeah, we can definitely speed this up. <laughs> 8 points to Ireland from Kevin. 10 points to Yugoslavia. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg at the top. What does someone get out of trolling like this? I don't understand. Um, a chuckle, maybe? And then... The realization of having a pointless life, but hey ho. Uh, Ellen, the dedicated Aussie, can't argue with that. Very dedicated indeed. Ten points to Ireland there, and a twelve to Luxembourg. And next is uh, Ricardo. The slap gives UK a big zero. Okay, well, <laughs> I read a little bit about that, but uh, I'm not too familiar with it. But um, I thought we were judging songs. If you like the song, that shouldn't change your opinion on it. But still, you do you. Uh, 10 points to France and a 12 to Luxembourg. And next is... Uh, don't work on Sunday, don't sleep on Monday from Vietnam. Yes, indeed. Uh, the United Kingdom moves to the top half there. Uh, 8 points to Spain to also move into the top half, 10 to Netherlands, and the 12 goes to, could it be? It is indeed Luxembourg. Uh, Grom. oh yeah, this was the boom bang. Well, let's see, let's see what, uh, what other songs are up the Grand Moss Alley. Uh, Ireland gets 8, Austria gets 10, and the 12 to Luxembourg. 
Um, definitely have a big battle going on for second at the moment. One point separating Austria and Ireland. Uh, Togravis Etera with the first points there. Uh, 8 points to Finland. 10 points to, to Denmark, that's huge. Moves them up a few places there at the bottom. And the 12 to Yugoslavia to go up into 5th place. And next is Victor. Uh, with these, the first points. Belgium moves out of Germany there. Austria and Ireland switching places again. Uh, Sweden with an 8. Luxembourg with a 10. And the 12 goes to uh, Yugoslavia to go up into 4th now even. Someone has to stand boom bang bang. Not me, but someone. Well, I mean, the juries back in 1969 were more than someone for some reason. Uh, Honor gives uh, 8 points to Spain. 10 points to Switzerland, which is a huge movement down there, and the 12 to Luxembourg. And next is Alipon di Napoli. Wow, that's oh, that's that's kind of cheeky. I like that. I like that. A uh, lot of movement at the bottom going on there. Belgium moves ahead a little bit. Sweden gets a big 10 to go tied with Portugal, and the 12. To Italy. A uh, few songs at the top there, not getting anything. Italy gets the 12. Uh, Flanders Dan Tobiax. Yes, indeed. Uh, Denmark making moves down there. Nothing else really happening at the moment. 8 points to Italy. 10 points to Yugoslavia. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg at the top. Netherlands need to rise to third for my predicted top three to be right. Well, they, ooh, they have a pretty big gap. It's Yugoslavia who's in fourth now. Uh, Tony is the next voter. Uh, no movement from the first few points there. Eight points to Finland. Ten points to Yugoslavia. And the 12 goes to Austria, who are now on 200 points. Uh, meanwhile, Luxembourg are on 319, of course. Uh... Plink Pop, I don't recognize that name, but welcome. Uh, France and Sweden making moves on the right side. Uh, 8 points to Austria, 10 points to Italy to go ahead of Netherlands there, and the 12 to Luxembourg. I'm telling you the real battle is for last place. Between, well, I mean, there are a few songs dragged into that one for sure. <laughs> Uh, no name puts Germany away from last place at the moment. Switzerland's back in it. Uh, eight points to Spain. Spain's gotten quite a few amount of eights. Like it's mostly just eights and then nothing else. Ten points to Italy and a twelve to Austria there on two hundred and twenty now. Uh, Yugoslavia has started to catch Ireland a little bit as well. I think um, as Bruno is voter number thirty four. Uh, Belgium and Denmark getting some valuable points there. 8 points to Austria. 10 points to Ireland. To close in on the 200 mark. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg. Uh, I don't think anyone's really uh, too interested in in uh, the lead. Uh, I think that's very much settled. But we can focus on other interesting and intriguing battles around the scoreboard. Polenta has some lower points there. 8 points to Ireland. 10 points to Spain, who are now into the hundreds as well. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg at the top to further extend. Uh, and next is uh, Tsuar, a creative name. <laughs> well, that's, I like that. I like that. That's very good. Um, 8 points to Austria. 10 points to Yugoslavia. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg yeah could could we actually see like Luxembourg get um, like how far up do we think like in the percentage table how far up do we think they can get I don't think they will really challenge uh, Nel Blue de Pinto de Blue because that was just ridiculous how many points it got but it could be up there you know Elendi gives 8 points to Portugal 10 to Austria and 12 um, again to Luxembourg 
Kevin predicted Lux, Austria, Yugoslavia, Ireland, Finland as top 5 in that order. That's a pretty good prediction, I have to say. Uh, Finland out of it at the moment, but other than that, you know. Finland are not too far away from it, yeah, honestly. Uh, 8 points to Ireland here from Sag Bape. <laughs> Sag Bape, I shall seek this. It's the 12 to Austria. It is indeed. Alipan, you think Luxembourg is going to land on 998 points? That would be something. Could happen, absolutely. Mr. 1978 Suetermeer. I feel like I've said this name before and I still have no idea how to. Could it overtake Haidada Luduyemo? I think so. How many did that score? That didn't score that many, did it? Uh, 12 more points to Luxembourg, anyway. Uh. I just checked United won the title in 65 and Everton finished 4th. Well, good times, wasn't it? <laughs> um, well, with that logic, 1987 would be the best year in the history of mankind. Uh, just Achilles gives 8 points to Netherlands, 10 points to the United Kingdom, who are now on 110, and 12 to Spain, who actually are starting to catch Finland quite heavily. Very close between Finland and Spain now. James S. We're almost, well, not really almost, but soon we'll be halfway through. Uh, Portugal goes back up on the left side there. 8 points to Austria. 10 points to Finland. And the 12 goes to Germany. Huge movement for Germany down there at the bottom. Rude, I hope you introduced Austria as Sag ihr ich lasse sie an in honor of your sport class. <laughs> oh, yeah, I will never live that down. Maybe, like, after doing these, like, I should absolutely do those sport quizzes again in the future once we've done all of the watch logs, because then maybe I'll know the titles a bit more. Her Crazy gives 10 points to Portugal and the 12 to Finland to move ahead of Netherlands now. Uh, Kevin, wasn't it you who predicted that, that top five with Finland in it? It's looking likely. Ambora Ambora from Australia is the next voter. Uh, eight points to Austria. 10 points to Ireland and the 12 goes to Luxembourg out of interest which Swedish team do you support um, I support Helsingborg which is kind of incredibly sad but it's been in my family for, for decades or yeah for decades to support them uh, we're not from Helsingborg would you su support them um, and they're terrible at the moment they were very good 11 12 years ago 12 more points to Luxembourg, by the way, in case you thought of something else. But yeah, Helsingborg were really good. In 2011, they won the league. And right now, they're at the bottom of the second division. So that's... Well, things change fast. <laughs> uh, Luis Lopez gives uh, the first points there. Monaco and Denmark getting some big points on the right side. 10 points to Spain. Uh, and the 12 goes to Luxembourg. like this little battle between Portugal and Spain as well at the bottom of the left side. That's quite quite fun. Uh, Tibor, voter number 46. Three horses voted today. This is what happens when the stream is at 10.40 a.m. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I guess you're right. A lot of points on the right side of the scoreboard here. Denmark gets quite a few. Netherlands with a 10. And the 12 to Luxembourg. And... Do you watch ice hockey at all? I don't. I think it's a lot of fun to watch it in real life, but on TV, I, I just get um, dizzy. I think it happens too much, and I haven't really been invested into it, so not really. Uh, Edward in Liverpool gives ten points to France. There, France now very close to the hundreds as well, and Austria with a twelve. Just shush, Rodmorg. They will absolutely not. <laughs> Uh, Norway is my biggest right side surprise. It's so good you guys. Oh, I I did not care for Norway, but um, Well good for you then Anton that it's not lost <laughs> uh, 10 points to Ireland from Marky and the 12 from goes to Austria Reference to the hosting in 1991 thought the group would get that. Oh No, I must have missed that um it's, uh, I, I haven't watched 1991 in so long, and when you watch it, it's just, it's a simple torture. Well done on the name, Anton, I like it. Anton the Danky Sontag Enjoyer, wonderful. Well done, I like it. 12 more points for Luxembourg there. 10 big points for Norway as well, which put it very close to Monaco and Denmark there on the right side. 
Good. Is Nicholas Edin the curling goat? I, I have n no idea. <laughs> I don't watch curling. <laughs> uh, Coriander is the voter number 50. Austria with 8. Netherlands with 10. Uh, Finland's moved down now again from away from that 5th place. And Luxembourg with 12 points now into the 500s. As we approach the, um, the halfway mark here after Polina's votes. So perhaps Luxembourg could get to the thousands, you know. Could happen. Regardless of there being so few uh, so few voters today. Oh, well, so few. But compared to the original. 10 points to Yugoslavia there from Polina, who's actually very close to Ireland, I just realized. 12 more points for Luxembourg. But Yugoslavia is absolutely going to put up a challenge to uh, Ireland here. You don't know Niklas Edin? No, because I don't watch curling. Why do Why do all of you watch curling? And why do you all expect me to know anything about it? Uh, Jason Lee gives 10 points to the UK and a 12 to Luxembourg. The girl who sang for Norway this year comes back in 67 and 69 and all three of her songs totaled 4 points. Well that is a very sad statistic, but I thank you for sharing. Um, Sammy XX Voter number 53, Italy now into the 200s as well, Spain or Switzerland getting big points there, 10 points to the Netherlands and the 12 to Luxembourg. Songs at the top not getting anything there. Uh, Ireland 65, indeed, that was, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, first points there, no movement. Italy and Netherlands very close to each other though, of course. Uh, 8 points to Spain, 10 to Austria, and a 12 goes to Luxembourg at the top. Uh, Groot, quick thing of another sport. Groot, do you watch um, water polo? I absolutely do not. And then you retracted your message right as I answered it. <laughs> uh, eclectic Learner um, gives 8 points to Finland. Finland and Spain very close to each other again now. Sweden gets a 10 there to move ahead of France. And the 12 to Portugal. A lot of songs at the top not getting anything there. Like 5 of the top 6 were blanked. Castilla La Mancha Jury from my bed today. Well, I can't wait to get to bed myself. And, and <laughs> we'll, we'll get there soon enough. 8 points to Spain. 10 points to the Netherlands to move ahead of Italy there for 5th and the 12 to Luxembourg at the top. And then it's Wizard the Tomato God. Well, you have to be God of something, why not tomatoes? I'll, I'll start referring to myself as the Carrot God after today. Uh, 10 points to Luxembourg and a 12 to the Netherlands. There we go. Uh, Groot, do you watch Equestrian? No, I do not. <laughs> um, I, I Like, really, the only sports I watch are football and Formula One, nothing else. Uh, Anna from Switzerland gives 8 points to Luxembourg, 10 points to Ireland, and the 12 goes to Austria. Uh, Mart from the Netherlands gives uh, smaller points there on the board, a few all over the place. Uh, 8 points to Yugoslavia, 10 points to Luxembourg, and the 12 goes to Denmark, nice one, up, on, up into the hundreds now for Denmark, very close to France as well. Any good books or TV shows you recommend? Uh, I don't know, depends on what you like. Um, my favorite book of all time is Candide, but that's probably not like the most accessible one. <laughs> uh, 10 points to Ireland here from Dimitris, I'm sorry Abraham Lincoln, <laughs> and a 12 to Luxembourg. Uh, maybe the king of carrot flowers. Carrot flowers? I don't understand. Oh yeah, we have the person who liked men and grapes here, um, with the cheeky name. Uh, 8 points to Ireland. 10 points to Luxembourg and the 12 to Austria. We'll add it to the list. Kevin, you sh or what? No, wait. No, I'm confused now. Oh, yeah, you, you asked for the recommendations. Yeah, uh, Kevin, Candide is a um, 
is a book from the uh, Enlightenment period. Um, it's it's not really like the most. <laughs> it's not like the other books that most people usually read. Uh, Furion gives twelve points to France to put it ahead of Sweden there on the right side. Uh, I think that that would probably be the first twelve for France, right? Uh, after sixty-two voters. Uh, voter number sixty-three is Neely. I'm so lost in, on all this Roman funeral business, but I took a Latin in school, and I can tell you that their public restaurants were very. <laughs> well, yeah, I think <laughs> we're all familiar with that. Uh, Twelve more points for Luxembourg there to extend their gap at the top. United Kingdom moved up into the top half. I just realized as well, and Spain has moved up ahead of Finland. I didn't realize. That's how good attention I pay. Um, Ander from France is the next voter. Eight more points for Yugoslavia there. Ten points to Finland to put it ahead of Spain. And the twelve to Austria. Austria very much on their own in second as well here. Uh, is Udo gonna put like a nice little staircase for his results? Because of course he came third in 64. And it looks like he's gonna get second here in 65. What's gonna happen in 66? We're yet to find out. Uh, Meg's votes are here. Thanks for streaming group. My pleasure. Thank you for thanking me. <laughs> um, 10 points to Austria and a 12 to Luxembourg. Finland being best Nordic country is surprising. It's like the only Nordic country that's actually doing well. <laughs> this one. Cosmic Sun is done really early. Yeah, I'd say. I'm so used to you being like either the last few voters or just missed the voting. Uh, 8 points to Denmark there, 10 to Luxembourg, and the 12 goes to Austria. Based on this, Ireland will win Grew Division before 1970. What, what makes you think that? <laughs> I'm not sure. Udo is not going to win 66. Well, how would you know, Andy? <laughs> like, you just can't say, oh, that's not gonna happen. Okay, <laughs> what am I gonna do with that information? We can't know. Uh, Romance Linguist gives 12 points to Austria there, 10 to Ireland, nothing for Luxembourg at the top. Norway to win 66. I don't remember what Norway sent in 66. Like 66 is such a vague memory to me. I remember I really like Spain, but other than that, I don't really remember too much. I will remember when we watch it, but yeah. Uh, Sebastian from United States of America gives 10 points to Italy and the 12 to Luxembourg at the top. Right as I say, I liked Spain in 66, Fiber says, Ugh, Spain better not win 1966. I didn't even know that they were um, they were well liked. I like that song though. Um, Mene gives Germany a few points there to get into the hundreds as well. Uh, 8 points to Ireland, 10 points to Luxembourg, and the 12 goes to Yugoslavia. Uh, Aims96 from the nor from Northern Ireland uh, has some points here. Norway moves ahead of Germany again. Uh, 8 points to France, 10 points to Austria, and the 12 goes to Luxembourg. I like his 67 one at least, but I wouldn't like that winning either. Yeah, I think his his song in 67 is better, but 67 is such a much like a much stronger year. 1967 is like the best year ever. It's it's not the best year ever, but it's up there, you know. From the 60s, it's absolutely the best one. Uh, Le Macedonien gives 10 points to Germany and the 12 to Yugoslavia. What's going on now? What happened? I'm sorry, I'm pausing. But Ellen, what are you doing? Uh, donor, I think that's Australian dollars five. Incredibly kind. I'm not sure why you're doing that, but okay. Just a little something to say thanks for streaming tonight. <laughs> I know it's late, uh, but we appreciate you smashing out these streams for us. Bring on 1966. Thank you very much. Uh, it's my pleasure. It's it was a late night, but I I'm happy you appreciate it, Ellen, and the the fact that uh, the fact that you, you I I'm happy that I could give uh, something for for the viewers who are not from Europe to actually match your schedule for once as well. Um, very kind of you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, not sure what else to say. I can say thank you many more times, but I don't think I will add more uh, impact to that. But it's very, it's incredibly kind of you, and it's my pleasure to do so. I'm having fun as well. Uh, trust me. Um, yeah, I guess we're moving on. Um, thank you, though, still. Uh, 
Jar is the next voter who's missing a flag for some reason. 8 points to Luxembourg, 10 points to Ireland, and the 12 goes to Austria again. Um, I've been here since the 1988 watch along. Well, I mean, I've been here since, um, well, I was born. Missy Lisi went to bed after voting. Well, then, oh, we can talk so much. Uh, we can talk down on her voting so much. Go at it. Go at it. Oh, you're not telling. Missy Lisi gave 12 points to Luxembourg. What a joke. Ha! Huh. Sorry. Uh, Bella is the next voter. These are the first points. Switzerland very much on their own in the last place still. They need they need some big points to, to change that for them. 8 points to Luxembourg, 10 points to Italy, and the 12 here goes to Austria. Uh, I see you. I can do it. I, I can do it, sure. Why not? Why not? You good? <laughs> Thank you, Rod Morgan. Incredibly kind and incredibly unnecessary, but um, you, you, you do you do what you do. Thank you. My respect. Um, sorry to glue smarts for just pausing your voting, but you, you gotta blame Rod Morgan for that one. Incredibly kind. Uh, not sure what else to say about that. I will scream into a pillow if I gave you this. Big respect. Big respect. Big. Blah, 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 blah. Big respect for streaming at two a.m. Mate. My pleasure. It's actually 3 a.m. now. <laughs> My pleasure. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, first points from Glusomars here. We have 27 voters to go after this one. 8 points to Spain, 10 points to Yugoslavia, and the 12 goes to Austria. Uh, Austria is actually like sneaking up. They're now only 200 points behind Luxembourg. Oh, how fitting, Rod Morg. Your votes are up next. Uh, as we were just talking about you. Um, Vice Vukov is my imposter. Er, okay. Uh, 8 points to Sweden, 10 points to Austria. Will you give your imposter a 12? You will indeed. I do very much approve. Not only because you sent me 5 bucks, but still. <laughs> um, Uppe is the next voter. Um... These are the first points. Monaco now into the hundreds as well. Let's see if Belgium can get there before the end as well. Uh, 8 points to Luxembourg, 10 points to Denmark, and the 12 to Austria as well. Austria is... the comeback. <laughs> uh, isn't this the best result of Austria? Yeah, it will be. I mean, they got their best result yesterday, and this one is a better result. So yeah, it will be. Unless they get nothing for the rest of this, and Ireland gets 12s from everyone. Uh, 8 points to Denmark here from Isabel A. Sonjohos... Yeah, that name. Uh, 12 more points for Luxembourg, though, at the top. I was half asleep, so good screaming woke me up. Thanks. No, no, no problem. I, I do my job. Um, Alipan, voter number 79. Uh, some points for the bottom two there to kind of push them towards their 100. Uh, 10 points to Austria and the 12 to Luxembourg at the top. Uh, I have a feeling Groot will approve of this top four. Um, yeah, Gr well, he approves of much more than the top four. <laughs> it looks like I just did this. I, I did this ranking today, kind of, almost. <laughs> you all didn't even vote, it's just me. Uh, Tigressa gives 10 points to Germany and the 12 goes to Luxembourg. This is not me. Are we deleting? Are we deleting the Alipan votes? I think we should. Like, you can't steal. Like, everyone who, who's watching these streams surely know that there's an Alipan Rusandal who also watches the streams. There's no way you've missed that. I'm deleting this other Alipan, and then we're going back, and I'm deleting you as well, Jacques. Um, okay, sorry about this. You got nowhere to go. Uh, we're deleting those. Wait, what number are we on? 80, kind of. 
somewhere around there. Samoan jury is the next one to vote anyway. So we'll get all the way there. Enjoy this sound of me clicking. Yeah, this goes not all the way. So all of songs except two were over a hundred, so that could tell me something. How far in are we now? 78, 79, 80. Is this someone jury? Yeah, okay, we're back. Alright, uh, next votes. These are the first ones. Um, we got 8 points for Ireland. I'm actually gonna bump this up just slightly. Uh, 10 points to Finland and the 12 to... Portugal! I was, I was expecting another Luxembourg and then Portugal comes out of nowhere. Portugal only one point behind Spain now again. They're still going at it, those two. Guti uh, from Chile with some smaller points there. Portugal moves ahead of Spain now. Uh, 8 points to the UK, 10 points to the Netherlands, and the 12 will go to Spain to go ahead of Portugal again. <laughs> Alright. Uh, those imposters are a disgrace of the interweb. Well, I couldn't agree more. Uh, at this rate, we're ending up with less than 100 voters. Yeah, that could happen, absolutely. Let's hope not, though. Uh, Lakmai gives 8 points to Ireland, 10 points to Italy, and the 12, could it be? Could it be? Could it be? Indeed, Luxembourg gets another 12. Uh, okay, next. Uh, no clever name. Some more points for Belgium. Belgium is now pretty close to the hundreds. Let's see if they could get there. Uh, 8 points to Ireland. 10 points to Portugal to again move ahead of Spain. And the 12 goes to Austria. Uh, I love people who blank these runaway winners. Like I just want to dive deep into their rationale. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. Like songs that get so many points that there are still people who don't like them. So uh, can we just delete the votes who didn't vote for Yugoslavia? <laughs> You really liked it that much, Rodmorg. I'm happy you found a favorite on that one. I like it as well. 10 points to Germany there, and the 12 from Udo, ghost producer of Austria 2012, gives 12 points to Luxembourg. Did, did you really need to be a ghost producer to produce Boki Mittain Popu? I'm, I'm not so sure. Uh, Carla, sorry I'm biased. Okay, well, we know where these 12s are going then. Finland, better look out. Uh, 8 points to Yugoslavia. 10 points to Austria. And the 12 to Portugal. Uh, isn't that the definition of dictatorship? Shh, no one has to know. It's only a dictatorship if you're being found out, right? You haven't done anything wrong until then. Or something. Uh, 8 points to the UK from Luca. 10 points to Luxembourg, and the 12 goes to Austria. Okay, we have uh, 15 voters to go. Llewellyn Watts is the first one of those. And these are the first points. Belgium now very close to the 100. Finland moves ahead of Portugal there again. Portugal gets back with an 8. Uh, 10 points to Austria, and the 12 goes to Ireland. Uh, Ireland very much on their own. I mean, Yugoslavia could catch them, but it's kind of a stretch, isn't it? Praia calling here are the results of the CV jury. Welcome back, Praia and the CV jury. Belgium with another one point. I think Switzerland to reach 100 is definitely looking like a stretch now. Uh, 8 points to Portugal. 10 points to Sweden to move ahead of France, and the 12 to Austria. Uh, Felipe, voter number 89, some more points there, no movement, nope. 
Um, got an 8 for Ireland, 10 for Austria, and the 12 to Luxembourg. So I guess Felipe will be very satisfied with the current top 4 because it matches him entirely. Uh, my 998 prediction looks dodgy now. Could absolutely reach 998, couldn't it? I think it could. Uh, Elte from uh, Sverige uh, gives uh, 8 points to Yugoslavia, 10 points to uh, Luxembourg, and uh, the 12 uh, point uh, to uh, Ireland. Sorry, uh, I just I just made fun of Elte for 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 my own way <laughs> for for my own country i don't i didn't know i don't know why i did that it's getting late from the windy isles belgium now on to 100 well done um only switzerland to go i guess eight points to ireland 10 points to austria and the 12 goes to sweden oh luxembourg with nothing there i feel wait from the windy isles this is the third time in a row i'm i'm like I'm 95% sure that this is the third time in a row that the From the Windy Isles has blanked the winner. I'm sure. I'm sure. Erin Gobrug. Well, sure. Uh, from Ireland. Some movement that... What, Portugal just took two places in one go? Netherlands has dropped back far, or Portugal has just climbed a lot. They're up in sixth place. Uh, 10 points to Luxembourg and the 12 to Ireland. But Portugal has... Wow, what happened there? Like, Portugal was here for... Well, it's it's a while ago now, but Portugal was here for not too long ago, and now it's up here. From 9th to 6th, very fast. Uh, it's gonna lose that 6th now, though, from Kingdom of Bohemia's votes, as Finland takes it back. Uh, 8 points to Italy, 10 points to Yugoslavia, and the 12 goes to... Luxembourg. All right, next up will be Andy. Well, we all know that Portugal will get points here because he's hyping it up in the chat. Uh, only seven though. So there were three other songs he liked more. Wait, let me see if I can remember correctly. I don't, oh, really liked Finland. I didn't even realize. Uh, and the 12 to Germany. Andy, you haven't complained enough about Germany being at the bottom today. I'm, I'm surprised. I need to hear about it. Uh, Jay Telles, seven voters to go. Switzerland gets a few points there. Nice for them. Uh, eight points to Spain. Ten points to Portugal to move ahead of Finland again there. And the 12 goes to Luxembourg. First time making fun of Swedish from me, I, I should get a medal or something. Who makes fun of Danish every stream? I've made fun of Swedish before, for sure. Maybe you just weren't here. Everyone is allowed to make, like, you can, you can make fun of everyone until someone tells you that it's enough and then you feel bad about doing it. <laughs> 10 points to Portugal from Rudolf Nureyev and a 12 to Austria, who are now on 700 points. And yeah, that 998 point prediction is now out the window, sorry. I stayed optimistic longer than you. Thomas from Chile. Maybe we just have more people from Chile voting, but I feel like I shouldn't be su suspicious. We'll just move on. Uh, 8 points to the UK, 10 points to Italy, and the 12 goes to Luxembourg. Uh... <laughs> Could I realize soon enough that Germany is a lost cause? <laughs> okay, well, I mean, everyone is a lost cause and compared to Luxembourg in this one, so... Uh, oh dear, I think Yugoslavia won't get third. Yeah, it's not getting third. No way. <laughs> Nukolova calling, Tonga has voted, gives 10 points to Austria and the 12 to Sweden. So Yugoslavia is definitely not getting third, I tell you. Sweden's gonna get um, 11th, I guess. Some, some positions here are kind of getting set now. Um, I think Portugal is actually going to take that sixth place, you know. It looks it looks pretty good for them. Uh, Mimikat's Festive Contraste gives 8 points to Luxembourg. 10 points to Sweden. Sweden's just racking up the points here at the end. And a 12 to 
Austria. Could Sweden actually even pass the UK? Probably not, because then both uh, Antipodi and ESC fan and myself would have to give it massive amount of points. Uh, it got seven, but yeah, it's, it's no. Belgium's moving ahead of Monaco, though, on the last voter. Uh, eight points to Portugal, ten points to Austria, and the twelve will go to Finland. Uh, don't think my points can even make any differences anywhere, really. Um, so yeah, these are completely useless, but you'll see them anyway. There you go. You see how much they change? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> and you see how much uh, the eight to Yugoslavia changes? Absolutely nothing. And the 10 to Austria? Absolutely nothing. And the 12 to Luxembourg? Absolutely nothing. There we go. Final results, as you can see them on screen right now. Um, satisfied with these? Are we? I'm good. Uh, Switzerland finished in 18th place, lost with 62 points. Sad for them, but um, hey ho. That's life. C'est la vie. Um, Monaco, 17th, only one point behind Belgium in 16th. Norway got 15th on 131, Germany in 14th, 159, only 9 points behind Denmark in 13th. Then France got 12th, over 200 points, 206, and Sweden in 11th on 259. And the UK got top 10, which is kind of, well, no, it's not a rarity in the 60s, they've done well, sorry. Uh, but back when we did the 80s watch-alongs, that was a rarity for them, I think. 272 points for the UK, uh, 289 for Spain, who got 9th. The Netherlands finished in 8th on 316. Finland got 7th on 358, only 5 points behind Portugal in the end, uh, in 6th. Uh, and then, wow, only 10 points actually from Portugal up to Italy, who got 5th here, 373 points. Then a massive 90 points up to Yugoslavia in 4th. A further 70 points up to Ireland in third, and then, well, <laughs> 215 points up to Austria, who got second, and then uh, 100 and, oh yikes, 180, no, 100 and, 181? No, what am I doing? I, ca I can't count. 179, maybe. How many points... Math is... I, I don't teach math, so you, you can't... This is just annoying me, though. How many... 21. So it should be 179 points, right? I think. Maybe. Anyway. Okay. Uh, here's the voting grid. You're gonna see a lot of... <laughs> a lot of 12s for Luxembourg. Holy hell. Okay. Yeah. Just, just look at all of these. Like, the, this era here. Wow. 2, 4, 6, 8... 10 12s in a row. Not bad, not bad. Um, yeah, those were the results. Did anyone get the top three correct? Luxembourg, Austria, Ireland, if you did. A cookie for you. And uh, yeah, thank you for joining me today. Now, everyone who's in Europe, go to bed, including me. And I will see you. I'm, I'm not sure... I'm not sure if we will stream tomorrow. I'll be... I'll be uh, I'll be visiting my dad tomorrow, but I haven't decided if I will stay for the night or not. But if I decide that tomorrow, then I will announce a stream tomorrow. If there is no stream announced tomorrow, then there we're not streaming tomorrow. Um, so yeah, simple as that. Be on the lookout on my channel tomorrow. If there comes up an announcement about a stream, then you know that there will be one. I will promise you that the next stream I won't have to postpone it like today uh, I'm I feel very bad still about that but I'm, I'm happy so many of you came out anyway I hope that it's not gonna be too much of a disappointment for everyone who couldn't make it but exactly like Meg said in the previous stream that uh, the Australians have been waking up at 4 a.m. to watch the streams so if a Europeans can't watch every single one then I mean it's it's just the way the cookie crumbles really uh, it's the le uh, yeah. I I think you 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 said it very well, Meg. When you when you said it much better than what I did now. Anyway, uh, I should. Uh, Rodmore wanted to see the amount of twelves for Yugoslavia. They had one, two, three, and then uh, 
four, five, six. Six twelves for Yugoslavia. So now you know. Uh, Groot, you don't have to do them on consecutive days if you don't want. That's the thing though, I want to. Like, I'm having too much fun watching these, but uh, it's just, if, if if my schedule works out, then I can do it. Uh, maybe I'm just over-optimistic with being able to stream as many times as possible. I think that that's kind of the thing. I, I feel like I, I want to stream more than I am able to. I, I should try and become a little bit more realistic. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for joining me today. I will be leaving you with our uh, new winner as soon as I found it on Spotify. There it is. Uh, so yeah, have a good one. See you whenever I see you. Uh, bye for now. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.